My name is Tevin Price. I was born with microthelmia coloboma. When I was a baby, the doctors told my family uh, that I would only be able to see uh, shapes and maybe colors. Uh, so if you think of um, a red school bus, um, to me that school bus was supposed to look like uh, some type of rectangular uh, object uh, that is a dark color. Um, but today, uh, I have do have blindness in my right eye, uh, where I have a prosthesis, and then in my left eye, uh, I have um, as close to normal vision as um, could be possible. Um, I still can't see very well far away, but I can make out that red school bus, um, you know, as long as it's getting closer to me. After Hayes was born, uh, we brought her home. Everything seemed really normal. Um, she slept a lot, she was a great baby. And about two months, we took her to the doctor. We thought she might have an ear infection. So the doctor brought up the nystagmus, the eye shaking. And so he said, um, you probably need to go see an ophthalmologist. And so we did. And um, they, they told us that she was blind. At, at IFB Solutions, uh, whether you're in our employment side or in our programs, everyone has a vision story. Um, but you know, the, the good thing about what we're able to do is if it's that person who is blind, who's never had a job, we're able to take that person in and give them some training and they're able to start contributing uh, to IFB and making great quality products. If it's that child who um, you know, has their own vision story, who didn't have a lot of self-confidence. We can help that child. We have, you know, the programs and services and things that can help build that self-confidence and give that person that opportunity. So I like to say we serve people from 3 to 103 and we literally do. And so all, all those people in between have, have their own stories and uh, we have an opportunity to help that person no matter what their need is. Coming to programs like the C program, uh, it taught me lots of independent skills, um, cooking being one, um, how to travel, um, how to speak, and do all of those day-to-day -day living things um, that you don't necessarily get uh, without a program uh, like the C program. We thought that Hayes was going to live with us forever. She wasn't going to go to college. Um, you know, we, we just thought it was like the end of the world, really. And um, so anyway, we've come a long way and um, having the help of these programs, meeting other people that are blind, getting to experience things that normal kids experience, a uh, typical kids experience. Um, they do the same things that everybody else does. And it's just been really nice to have other blind people around and not feel like you're so alone. Not that I'm not normal, but like when I'm here, I feel like, you know, just like everyone else. And also like, you know, I've helped people, people have helped me. We've th found things in common, you know, we can talk about the same things. I, I just think it's great.